Hi dancers, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna to be doing a stretch and recovery routine. And this routine is gonna be a great one either on a day off from dancing, or you can do this after you've taken class. So all you're gonna need for this rotation is something to pad your joints with, like a pillow or even a mat. And you're gonna need a yoga block or something that's about like a yoga block. But before we get started, hit that subscribe button below, like, and let's go ahead and get started on our stretches now. Let's go ahead and start today's routine by sitting on the yoga block. We're gonna go ahead and sit with it lengthwise under our pelvis. And we're gonna just slide these legs open and let them drop into external rotation and just loosen up your hips by going side to side. Nice gentle rocking motion here. And we're gonna keep our spine nice and tall and straight in the legs. And this is not a deep stretch yet, we're bending. And straighten, and bend, and straighten, and bend. And let's go ahead and walk forward and keep those knees rotated out. Go forward to the best of your ability here with keeping both hip bones down on the yoga block and keeping the spine in neutral so we're not coiling under our spine. We're not rocking and lifting the sits bones. Deep breaths here in and out. In and out. And we're gonna come back up and go ahead and straighten the legs now and rotate back again and keep those sits bones on the yoga block. And we're going to pour a rough forward, keeping the spine in neutral and rotating those hips back. And we're gonna take a big exhale, come up. We're gonna just bend one knee in. We're gonna really open and externally rotate that hip. Flex this leg back and stretch to the straight knee. And come back up. Open the hip and stretch over the bent knee. And come back up and let's go ahead and adjust ourselves so that we can switch to the other side. Keeping those hips square and stretching to the straight leg. Deep breaths, release the tension in your bodies. And come back up and stretch towards that open turned out leg. Great work, exhale. And adjust your block here so that you can go ahead now and you're gonna sit on it and allow that front leg to come off into an attitude front position, external rotation. And this leg is gonna just hang out in the back here. We're going to push the knee down and lift through the back of the spine and hold one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and relax forward. Deep breaths. And walk up. And you're gonna go ahead and take that yoga block and then switch to the other side.
Line yourself up here and start with lengthening through the spine and pushing this front knee down. And exhale, stretch forward. Good, and go ahead and take that block away. Grab either your mat or your padding and put it under your knees. We're going to kneel here and we're going to take a little bit of a segmental roll and we're going to go down through the spine from the top of the head all the way back to child's pose and roll up. And little arch back and down. And back up and remembering I am in my third trimester of pregnancy. So I do have limitations with my range of motion and ability to move here. Move to your best ability, whatever your body is telling you on any given day. Good. And now we're gonna go ahead and stretch our legs out and you're going to rock forward and drop those hips to the ground and then come back up. And yes, I am in a wide position here. And if you could bring your spine all the way down to the floor, allow yourself to do that. Listen to your body. One more rock here. Good. Bring your legs back in. And one leg is going to go on this pad or your mat. The other leg is going to come to the front. And now we are going to rock forward and tuck our chin forward, rounding our upper back. These are gentle rocks. Now go ahead and come back to neutral. We're going to bring our elbows together and we're going to open up through the spine and look back. Upper back opens. Come back down, switch the leg, and tuck under and roll the spine. Rock forward, nice and gentle. Come back to neutral, bring those elbows up and extend through the upper back and back to neutral. Extend and back to neutral. Exhale every time you go back, exhale and back to neutral. One more. Bring those arms down. Bring your feet back. And let's go ahead and get up into downward dog here. And push those heels, lift the hips.
and bend the knees and go ahead and grab your yoga block for this next stretch we're going to lift our heels up with the yoga block and drop our toes down while our knees are bent in butterfly we want to do this because we don't want to enforce the sickling of the ankle or the foot. And we're going to port a bra forward and hold, push the knees out. Gently come back up. Go ahead and put your yoga block off to the side. And let's go down to the floor. Lift one leg up, parallel, flex it back, and pull it in as close as you can. And hold. And straighten that leg, cross this over your body, and then rotate. And allow this to go as far as you can. You can even bend your knee if it's more comfortable that way. And open the hip up. And back down. Take the other leg up and flex. bend the knee or keep it straight and twist bring that leg back through and come up we're going to come into a nice long lunge here and feel free if you'd like to go down in your splits after this you're welcome to do that and hold your splits for an additional 20 to 30 seconds after this rotation is over And come back up, swing your other leg around, and come forward. And come down. Great job today, dancers. Thank you for joining me for this little stretch and recovery routine. If you liked today's video and you'd like to see more content like this, then join the Veronica K platform. And I have an injury prevention portal as well as guided step-by-step -step courses to help you grow as a dancer and stay safe. If you wanna try the first month for 50% off, scroll below in the description and grab the promo code. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, hit the like button, and share with a friend. See you next time.